How goes it everybody? My name is Howitzer and welcome back to SnowRunner. Like, subscribe, all that good stuff for me. And of course today I got another mod to show you. So let me show it to you. The TRK Crevasse OR4 by M181. Max Mike 181 brings us this one and I do believe it's modeled after the GMC Canyon. I'm pretty sure. Put it down below. I, 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 I think it's the Canyon. <laughs> I'm not exactly sure. But let's see what we can do to it. All right, for engines. Oh, kind of looks like uh, regular in-game engines. Hopefully not. Looks like we have the 5.8, the 6.2, and the 6.2T. Uh, let's go with the 6.2T. Best power, anyway. Gearbox. Looks like we got stock crawler box, and then the slider box. I'll, I'll go with the crawler box. Suspension. We got stock, raised, and tuned custom. Looks like we'll go with the tuned custom. Try and get it up in the air as high as we can. Tires. Oh, he's got a decent little selection of tires. Let's go with these 35 inch MMR Assassins. We'll see how good they are. Hopefully they're a custom tire. Winch, got Stock Scout, Advanced Scout, and Autonomous Scout Plus. Oh yeah. Diff lock, well that's already engageable. Snorkel, oh yeah. Ray add-ons, we can put a spare wheel there. Get some trunk supplies, some fuel and some repair parts. Or you can do all three. Repair parts, two wheels, and some fuel. Let's do that, sure. Never know when you're gonna need it. Miscellaneous. Looks like you got some uh, some side pipes. Looks like it's just some side steps, really. Ah, sure, let's put those on. Rooftop, got some roof-mounted fog lights here. A roof rack. Some more fog lights, some LEDs. Got the old sun visor there. Let's do the LEDs, that looks kinda cool. Front bumper. We can put the bowl bar on. Ah, sure. Colors, looks like just some regular colors. We'll do like this grayish, sure. Of course you can do bobbleheads and other accessories too. Well, let's go see how this thing does. Hopefully it does okay. I mean, it looks pretty cool. Yeah, doesn't look too bad. Let's get a little interior shot here. I mean, it kind of looks like a newer GM truck, don't it? Well, it doesn't sound too bad. Well, full trailers. They're just the scout trailers. All right, maybe we'll do that later. Put it in full drive right away. Let's go see how this thing does. Yeah. Oh boy. Oh boy. Not today, Mr. Pole. Yeah. We'll take her down in a little mud pit here. Ooh. Oh, we buried it. Right away. Let's lock the diff once. Ooh. Well, oh, that's not good, is it? Doesn't look too good for this thing, does it? Uh. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Now we're starting to move. I guess if you're going to use this as a scout... Don't pick it through stuff like this, because you ain't going to make it too happy. Alright, after some careful winching, we are moving. Yeah, definitely don't take it through the deep stuff. It doesn't really seem to like that at all. All right, let's see how it does going through Swampy Town once. I don't think it's gonna like this at all. Let's put it in low and lock the diff right away. Try and give it its best opportunity that it can here. I mean, it's slowly making its way through it. Definitely doesn't like the real deep stuff. I mean, after all, it is modeled after a mid-sized truck, I guess. Alright, let's just call it right there, because... It would take me fucking half an hour to get through this area. Let's go do some other stuff. Yeehaw! Woo! 
Oh, stop. Oh, Jesus. Come on, get up on the rock. There you go. I said get up on the rock. There we go. see if we can get this front end up. There we go. Alright, it doesn't really seem to like anything that I throw at it. Yeah, these... These tires are not made for... for rocks, that's for sure. Well, I guess we'll skip this too. All right, let's go pull a trailer, I guess. I, I don't know. Let's see how it does this, I guess. We'll take her down the little trail here. Let's see how it does this part. Let's try to avoid the mud right there, because I know we'll bury the damn thing. Let's see if she'll if she'll pull the hill. All right, well, it's doing this okay. That's kind of nice to see. After everything we've seen so far. I mean, it held six gear up that hill. That was, that was all right. I mean, I guess this kind of scouting around wouldn't be too bad for this thing. Trying to look at the positives here. Yeah. Oh shit. <laughs> oh. Ooh. We're all right. Oh. <laughs> Let's just keep on going here. I mean, it certainly seems like the engine has plenty of power. That's for sure. Yeah. I mean, it's doing this part fairly decent. A lot of fucking wheel spin, though. It's skating all over the place. I wonder if it would pull this hill. I don't think the tires are good enough. Come on, little truck. Come on. You got this. Come on, you're so close. Okay, I was not expecting it to actually do it. Wow, okay. Huh. That did that okay, too. When in doubt, throttle out. Just keep your foot to the floor, I guess. Alright, we'll go back down. We'll take her down the hill. Uh, oh, oh, oh boy. Oh no. Oh, camera. Oh my god. Yeah, alright. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> oh. That was pretty cool. I mean, it's not doing terrible. I guess you just got to keep it off the rocks and out of the really, really deep mud. Which in this game is kind of hard to do. Because you never really know what you're going to get into. Let's see how it does going through this. 
I mean, it held eighth gear through that. Oh, damn. I thought it was going to keep holding it. Oh. That's all right, I guess. Let's see how it does going through the puddle here. Way too much wheel speed. All right, let's drop it in low ones. All right. Oh, it crawled out of that okay. Way too much wheel speed again. <laughs> it just wants to spin those tires so damn bad. Goodness gracious. All right. I've seen all I need to see. Well, that was the TRK Crevasse OR4. I was probably dogging on it pretty hard. It is a smaller Scout. I think the tires might need a little rework. I, I don't know, but it looks amazing. Whoever did the model did a really, really good job. A really good job. I mean, it makes plenty of power. It's just getting that to the ground. That's the main problem. And pulling the trailer did okay. But for some reason, by itself, well, I was kind of pushing it a little hard, I guess. Keep it out of the deep mud. Keep it off the rocks. It seems like you'll do damn fine with this thing. Good job with this one. I didn't mind it. A couple spots it did a pretty poorly, but overall I'd say it did okay for a mid-sized vehicle. So if you enjoyed this video, give it a like. Hit that subscribe button for me too, and I will hopefully see you in the next one.